So why should we even think about measuring social impact? Well, I suppose fundamentally as social enterprises and voluntary and community groups, community interest companies, charities, community benefit societies, it's our reason for being. These organisations are created to achieve social purpose. So that's the fundamental number one reason I think people want to measure social impact. I know for our business, it's something we felt really important over the 10 years of, of delivering our services. But there are lots of other very practical reasons as well for measuring social impact. It's going to help us improve the credibility of our organisations. It gives us information to help us improve our services. It can help us inspire all our staff and volunteers throughout our organisations from trustees and directors right through to um, you know, frontline staff. It certainly can provide powerful pu publicity and marketing materials to help get the message out there about our work and our good causes. I suppose also a really, really simple reason is it will help you secure future business through contracts and funding and connections you're going to make with other organisations because they want to work with organisations making a difference. So they're the main reasons for measuring social impact.